Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I spoke English on this channel and that is because I am Hungarian in case you didn't know. But today I wanted to do a hopefully a very useful video for everybody that is in their homes in lockdown. <laughs> And I wanted to help by giving you guys some tips about how to preserve your makeup and how you can use your makeup as slowly as possible so that you don't need to go out shopping, you don't need to repurchase your makeup items in a time of a lockdown. So if you guys would like to know, then just keep watching and don't forget to subscribe. My first tip would be you can use your makeup items for multifunctional purposes. For example, I've mentioned this before on my YouTube channel where I was on a makeup job once and I forgot to bring eyeliner. So my only option was, was to use mascara and put it on an angled brush and just use this as eyeliner. Now it provides the same exact look. True, it does dry a little bit quicker than a traditional liquid eyeliner, but it does the same exact job. And you know when you have that little gloop, you could just use like a brush to use that goop and just put it on your eyelid and it works great as an eyeliner. So you're not using your eyeliner, you're using your mascara for both purposes and therefore you are preserving your favorite liquid eyeliner. My second tip is, this might be um, obvious, is that when you're home, wear as little as possible or no makeup because of the fact that we are using up the product every time we are applying it to the face. So for every time that you put on your lip liner, you know you're just gonna have to sharpen it the next time. Try to not wear makeup when you're staying at home to an extent because obviously you wanna feel like a person who is alive. So it's okay to put on makeup sometimes, just not every day. Now the other thing is, is you know, people have this idea that you can only use eyeshadow for your eyes when in actuality, that's not completely true. You can also use your face products. So for example, your bronzer, your contour palette, you can use these browns as an eyeshadow. And it actually is sometimes, it does the same exact thing as an eyeshadow would. It's just you're using up your face products for your eyes and you are preserving your favorite uh, eyeshadow palette. You can also use your blush. Sometimes makeup artists will actually use the same blush that they use on the face to go a little bit in the eye because it kind of makes the whole makeup look more cohesive and it creates that monochromatic look and you use the blush as the eyeshadow basically and you're using up your face products instead of your eye products and therefore you are preserving your favorite eyeshadow palette. I also like to sometimes when I, I use a lipstick, dab it on my lips and I also dab it on my cheeks. So the lipstick can act as a cream blush. And it's just a really quick tip if you want to save time. What I do all the time is when I'm filling in my eyebrows, I like to use my eyebrow product. This is a brow pomade by Revolution. And I like to use this, it's basically like a gel eyeliner. And when I use it on my brows, I also use it really quick on my eyelid just to add some definition in my, into my lash line. It makes your lashes look naturally thicker. It also, it also saves time because you're using the same product on your brow and also on your eyelid. It's really long wearing, so I actually really like to use this on my eyelid as an eyeliner. And again, you're saving up your eyeliner. And another thing that I learned how to do is when I am putting on my foundation, usually when I'm in a rush, I don't care. I just take the foundation and I just like pump it on to my face. What I realized is that that way you're actually sometimes using a little bit more product than what you actually need. So what I do is I squeeze it onto my finger 
and I dot it like four ways or five ways across my face so that there is an equal amount of product on all sides of my face every single time I'm not using more than I need because if you just go straight in start pumping away you can waste a lot of product that way and if I pump it onto my finger and then I just dab it I know that my whole entire face will be covered in product oh and you know if you have a favorite makeup product try not to use it every day i mean i know that i have some products like my my mac lip liner in sore and this isn't a cheap thing so <laughs> i don't use this every single day and also i know that i'm not going to be going into mac anytime soon so i am saving this for special occasions only so that's it for me i hope that you guys found this video useful i hope you guys are doing well in your quarantines and if you are experiencing a lockdown in your country i hope that you guys are okay and that you guys are staying home and being safe and washing your hands and disinfecting your phones and social distancing and this too will pass okay thank you guys so much for watching my channel and if you would like to see more don't forget to subscribe i will see you guys very soon if you would like to follow me on instagram i post a lot of things on there and makeup related stuff too thank you so much and i'll see you in my next video